Something significant tends to occur. Stay with us. Live coverage coming up of Arsenal versus Chelsea from North London. Arsenal and Chelsea, who took part in the very first Football League First Division match between two London clubs. That was back in 1907 in front of 65,000. They're about to meet here at the Emirates. I'm Derek Ray on the gantry and Stuart Robson is next to me. Stuart, this ought to be special. Well, it should be, Derek. It's a rivalry that's really grown in recent times, but one that has provided some excellent games. Let's hope it doesn't disappoint today. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays alongside Thomas Partey in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Gabriel Jesus. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Kepa begins in goal. Thiago Silva plays alongside Kalidou Koulibaly in central defence. Denis Zakaria plays alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Thanks to Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the game. It ought to be a really interesting battle. Chelsea kick off. Mount. And return to Havertz. How can he take them on and beat them? And the cross goes in. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. certainly wasn't a clean tackle and the referee has got to book him I think well there we have it the first yellow card of the game and he's going to have to be careful now there's a long time to go here Martin Erdegaard well, Arsenal have lost the ball here. Ziyech. Now with Havertz. You know, it's always a tantalising prospect watching Martin Odegaard close up. Stewart, what do you think we might see from him? He quartered the attack illegally. Now perhaps a card is forthcoming. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Martinelli well he really read that brilliantly Jorginho Kukureya a move of promise on the flank Havertz well the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong Stuart well he has to make the keeper work harder than that that's a tame finish well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. <laughs> K. 
careless in possession. Ziyech. Zakaria. Oh, fancy footwork. Real chance. Oh, that's a fine save. Short corner favourite. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Well, they fancy a short one. And delivered into the box. Well, not cleared away completely. And problem solved for now. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw in. Granit Xhaka. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. Really good challenge. But attacking possibilities. Has a go. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. Well, far from the ideal pass. Ziyech. Now that attack going up a dead end, and the keeper has the ball. And an astute piece of defending. There's a slide rule pass. He just needs to keep a cool head. And he fails to deliver that time and the referee now going back to deal with the earlier incident a yellow card it's going to be And promising stuff from Arsenal. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Kai Havertz. An awful lot of green space to run into. Interception to snuff out the danger. Jesus well he's given us away Ziyech can they hit on the break Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So Chelsea restart the game. Can they come up with an answer? Mount. And Havertz. What can Chelsea do from this position? Well, it didn't go to plan in the end. Ross will get the advantage from the referee. A chopping challenge. And the referee has got to have a big think about it. 
Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Martin Odegaard, Saka, can he find the right pass? A fine block. And it's Gabriel Jesus, and Chelsea regaining possession. Zakaria. And Kai Havertz, and couldn't keep himself onside. Advantage, Arsenal. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. Promising sequence. And let's give credit to the defending. And that was a very fine read. Partey. And there we have it. The first half action is over here at the Emirates. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations. Arsenal with the lead going into this second half, but no room for complacency. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Will he play it in? The outcome is a goal kick here. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. it forward it's still alive and a time for calm on the ball Mount Havertz Kukureya and it's a quality pass terrific block Felix real chance oh good work to deny the opportunity And he has options available, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Partey. Thomas Partey. And promising stuff from Arsenal. Xhaka being egged on by the crowd. Well-timed tackle. This might be ideal for the counter. Mount. 
Can he find the net? A gift for any goalkeeper. Gabriel Martinelli. This is a message for Adriano Negri. Happy birthday, Adriano, and have a fantastic day. Determined and defending. To Armstrong and Matthew. Kukureya. Joao Felix. They're moving the ball impressively here. Joao Felix. Great block. Well, he got the touch on the ball. And so a corner it'll be. And time for the change now. He's driven in the corner. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And a chance to level it. Well, it's gone in. A goal for Chelsea, who now are level. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Gabriel Jesus. Just the challenge that was required. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have really that was going to be offside that's a poor decision to play that pass well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game Now, options are plenty. Havertz. And here's Ziyech. And attempting the through ball. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Party. And Kessia. Can they hit on the break? Defenders need to cover. Can he finish? And the keeper stretching to deny him. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Who's going to get on the end of it? As a defender doing his job clearing it off the line applying vigorous pressure well he knew he had to get to the ball and he did the last one haven't been at their best but just listen to these fans they believe a winner's coming here Jorginho on the ball Zakaria on the offensive, is there to be late excitement? And still danger here. Well, able to survive that attacking push. 
Well, I thought that was game over. It's a great save from the keeper just to keep them in this. I must say, this looks promising. Kovacic. Targets available. Cross comes in. Flattered away. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Can they take advantage of the situation? Wonderful chance. Oh, fine save. And it remains all square. Well, he saved his team there. That's a big moment for the keeper. And they will make the... Change now. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch, number four, Ben White. Coming onto the pitch, number 17, Cedric. And there's the delivery. Poor execution with regard to the corner. Getting forward. all even well they won't get another chance like that that's a really poor effort it's far too easy for the keeper in the end still pushing for a winner flirting with more than a bit of danger following that challenge he's already been booked and he is going to pay the ultimate price well when you're on a yellow card it was a silly challenge he just lost his discipline there So making the substitution now. Oh, terrific free kick. And how well the keeper did to parry it. Well, there it is. I'm not sure what all the fuss was about. It wasn't even close in the end. And he's fired over the corner. Oh, and the chance goes a begging. Well, relief for the keeper. That should have been the winner just there. There we have it. The 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides.